it's so validating for me and Jesse to know that through a conversation that we had with you, you guys got to connect on that artistic level. Mm-hmm. Uh, and it's, it's just reminding us that these conversations, you know, you do what you do in the musical world and the fact that we have these conversations on this platform and they're bringing like-minded people together as well for this Patreon page, you know, everybody who supports this show on here is such a generous and beautiful soul and has become like, you know, our inner circle of friends over the, you know, the short few weeks that we've, we've launched the page and yeah, it's all just very inspiring stuff. Well, I don't want to, I don't want to keep you much longer, but I do want to say, I want to rebut all of that. One, I love you very much. Uh, two, I'll send you the record. I can't believe I haven't done that yet. Uh, uh, and three, honestly, like I felt a kinship with Jesse when we did the episode because I think we got into a much heavier <laughs> conversation about our upbringings and our lives, and and and, and um, I felt very comfortable uh, with both of you guys and. Um, and ultimately, if you look at that list of people who are on the record, they're all people I've known forever. And then there's Jesse. And it was like a person who I felt like I've known forever. And um, um, and, and so, yeah, I mean, that, like he can attest to how it went. It was an email and I was like, no pressure. If you like it, let's go. And then you're like, I'm demoing some kill switch stuff. I'll bang this out. And then the rest is history. And so I, I feel like that's the way that kind of shit should go. Um, um, it's, I love this new world. Um, and I actually have been learning a lot about it. It's, it's not something we've really done in the past other than like calling up old friends and being like, Hey, I wrote this song. It was really influenced by you. Cause we spent fucking 10 weeks on tour together. Can we, uh, can you sing on it? Cause that's kind of how it went with Tim and Brian, like that song is really bad religion leaning the bridge really sounds like rise against them like why don't we lean into these influences and just call these people up because we know them but um but ultimately i think that that is the exciting part of this you know Mm. where where your podcast was born where where it's gone now just just keep doing it you guys are incredible to talk to and um i said it before i'll say it again Part three, whenever you're ready, I'm coming back. (laughs) It's just, you know, it's just so easy and we could go on. We could, we really could. Um, And I think eventually when we do do this live, because it's going to happen at some point when we take, you got to be part of the in-person around the fire tribute to Joe Strummer. We eventually need to have. Um, And yeah, it's always a pleasure to talk to you. And I, I, I completely agree with you. I got off that podcast being like, I, this guy's my friend now. So it's been nice to, do that via social media and to, to follow up with this and one day do this in person, but uh, total pleasure. And I commend you on some other level of doing punk rock, a total service by what you're doing with your lyrics and your concepts and the way you're thinking it's thinking man's punk rock. It's not lazy. It's, it's really helping to take that culture and put it into a whole other upper echelon. And i totally can't wait to hear the record and pleasure man total pleasure i'm buzzed off this conversation thanks boys love you both very much um good luck with whoever's got to follow that yeah